Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Whoops. Last episode, we, uh, it, last episode didn't go too well. We tried to do a bunch of side quests, and we had two problems. One, one of the side quests had us going literally all over the map to get items, so we're going to come back to that one. Secondly, we have one where we need to get 3,000 rupees in 30 bundles of wood. And last episode, we actually rage quitted because in the same place, we had a trial. I thought the trial was going to be fun. The trial was not fun. It was this one right here. <laughs> it was not fun at all. I had a very rough time. So last episode, I said we were going to do more story progress stuff. And by story progress, I mean I'm going into the map way too much. We're going to start from here and kind of make our way over here to the next Divine Beast. But I'm not going to lie to you guys. I kind of rage quitted this game for a few days after that. And I came back and I realized, let me just suck it up and really catch up on these side quests. Get everything done. It's not that big of a deal if I gotta go get 3,000 rupees. Because I have a lot of gems. And I just went and like kind of checked prices before I started recording. And I'm pretty sure I have 3,000 rupees already. I got 30. No, I don't have a woodcutter's axe. Uh, we'll go get another woodcutter's axe. But basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to be doing side quests probably for the next two, three episodes. Just to really catch up and get everything done and out of the way. We're going to be going into Zora's domain, doing the side quests there. At least as much of them as we can. And by the end of the episode, we will buy our house, because I deem that very important. So, I'm going to cut back to when, probably when I'm starting a quest over in here. And I'm going to get the wood off screen, and we will figure out what we're going to do about the rupees, if I'm just going to sell all my gems, or if I am just going to do side quests and collect treasures and go that route. So, I will see y'all in about two seconds for you, about 30 minutes for me. All right, after like an hour of gathering stuff we needed for the quest, we are finally back. So this is the first side quest. This is the Luminous Stone Gathering. I think I already um, started this one. I just kept on going back to this area to grind for the Luminous Stones in case you are wondering. So let's talk to him. Yes, hello. Did you need something from me? Here are your stones. Thank you. You really are giving me 10 luminous stones? Apparently these are worth, like, a good amount of money. In that case, please excuse me while I count them. And a one, and a two, and a three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Oh my, you really brought all ten. Thank you. Yes, I will happily take those luminous stones from you. Oh, that's right. I must reward you. Ooh, those might go for more. <laughs> and what's more, I'll give you one extra as a bonus. Oh, pff, well, goody, goody. You're a lifesaver, truly. If you ever find yourself in possession of ten luminous stones in the future, I hope you will bring them to me. But if that happens, know that I'll only be able to give you one diamond for them. <laughs> I would be honored if you'd accept it when that time comes. I'm pretty sure gems are used to upgrade armor. And I'm sure diamonds are used to upgrade really good armor. So we're going to have to remember that. Alright, next one. Is it down there? No. Oh, hello, friend. Yo. <laughs> it's rare to see your kind. It's rare to see your kind here too. <laughs> oh, he said you could touch shock arrow, so he's like valuable. Okay, that's cool. Uh, let me cut back to when I find the next. Wait, is it right here? It might be right here. Ha ha ha! They say Ruda has calmed down, and yet. Ah, it is you, Link. I am sorry, I was talking to myself. What's wrong, buddy? The truth is, my wife, Mai, has left me and hasn't come back yet. 
After the divine beast Va Ruda started rampaging, she went out to go fishing like everything was normal. And now, Ruda has settled down, but she still hasn't returned. Oh. I'm afraid the worst has happened. If only I had stopped her from leaving. Oh, what do I do? I'll go get her. Link, you saved Zora's domain and now you're going to help me find my Mai as well? Mm. You are a true champion. I'm sorry to put this burden on you, but please, please bring her home. Alright, a wife washed away. Whoa. Yes. Uh. If you want to look for Mai, I will help however I can. Please ask me anything. Where could she be? The day Ruta started re raging, she said she was going fishing in the Zora River. Ruta's rage caused the river to swell. She might have been swept downstream. However, if Leto's group didn't see anything, maybe she passed through Zora's river and is beyond there. Oh. Worst case scenario, she's been carried all the way to Lake Hylia. Oh. Do you have any more questions? Oh. Mai is my wife. She's also Tumbo and Kay's mother. She spends her days catching fish and selling them at the general store. Aww. Unlike me, she is very lively and cheerful. I suppose Tumbo gets that from her. Mm -hmm. Do you have any more questions? Mm -hmm. I do not. Alright, so the Hylian River. Which would be... Uh... Okay, so she's like all the way down here, so... So, we're gonna go, we're gonna go here, there's a trial along the way, so we're gonna go there, we're gonna hit the trial, we'll hit the tower, and we'll find her after that. I think I'm gonna go hit that tower first, honestly, and then I'll just jump off and go to the shrine from there. Yeah, that's the plan. I'm gonna cut away until we find something interesting or we get to that tower. You know, this game really is beautiful. I can't believe I just walked into that. Hello, friend. <laughs> Goodbye, friend. I like how you just steal weapons. Like, I just haven't gotten over how just douchey that is. Like, imagine you're fighting someone, they smack you down, just take your weapon. That was weird. Looks like he was like disappearing. Hmm. Yay, tower! We love towers. 
This one's like a safe tower too, so I probably should. Ooh, hello. Yeah, we'll let him live. I'm just enjoying dinner. It's so nice being able to just climb these fast as hell. Also, with this next trial we do, we'll be able to go get two upgrades. I'm gonna gun health. I'm just gonna keep on gunning health because I feel like I'm just in fear all the time. And, like, the stamina is nice. It's, like, th this half of, or I don't think it's even half a bar, but this, like, quarter, third of an extra bar that I got. It feels like it's all I need, and there is food that restores stamina, but I still get one hit. And I don't like getting one hit. <laughs> like, it's really demotivating when I'm just running through an area, and I just get smacked by something, or like clipped by something, and I just drop. And it's like, oh, well, I died. But yeah, that's another tower unlocked, and we get this whole region now. Really makes me wonder if I went the correct order of, like, events. Like, it's gonna be really weird if, like, the last area I go to is the easiest. Oh, well. That's the beauty of open world. Cool. Alright, let's... Um, we gotta go here. That's our goal. So, north. Alright, let's jump off. And we want to be this way. I love paragliding. The paragliding thing in this game is really cool. Just being able to, like... What. The. Fuck. Is that? Um, uh, um, okay. That coming at that's coming after me. We need to get in here. Let's go. Go 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 go. <gasps> what is that? I take back everything I said. You were not supposed to come to this area early. Was that a dragon? Was that a freaking dragon? Oh sweet dear God. I think that lady's supposed to be like somewhere around here too. So I don't, I don't know where she is. I she might got messed up at the wrong neighborhood. Oh, that's crazy. All right, what do we got here? To you, sets foot in the shrine. I am Yanag. I am. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shatter of the heavens. What do we got going on? Do I put a bomb in here? Drop. Uh huh? Okay, so bomb goes in. And big boom boom happens. Do I do I think if I get on top I just die. Yeah, well, when I find out. Getting on top of this bad boy. Ow. What the heck are you supposed to do? Can I put two bombs? Is 
So drop that. Oh. Drop that. Ha ha ha. Now we get on. If I can get up, there we go. And drop that bad boy in. Oh, I messed that up. I'm going to have to go back down, aren't I? That could have been bad. Oh, I love the eightfold blade. Little katana thing. Sick. All right, cool. She's supposed to be around here somewhere. Where's that dragon? Yeah, he went away. He knew who he's messing with. I'm just kidding. He, <laughs> I'm pretty sure he was. Oh, it's one of those lizards. I'm pretty sure he was shooting um, lightning bolts at me, and I was about to die. Is that her? That looks like her. There she is. We got a big haul today. Fishing is so much fun. Do you know Frank? Hmm. Frank? Yes, he's my darling, my love. Why? Is something wrong? What? My darling, I'm sorry. I'm. I completely forgot. I got carried away. I, I, I've got to go back home right now. Here, you can have these. Ah, cool. Okay, now they're all yours. Now then, time for me to go home to Zor's Domain. See ya. So I want you to know that I don't read these side quests when I'm looking up the items for them. Because before this... I went and got, well, okay, I guess I failed because I only caught four, but I went and supposedly caught five of the Staminaka Bass. So, yeah, I thought you needed that for this side quest, but you didn't. <laughs> Whoops. All right, back to Zora's. Alright, let's start these little guys. La la la, a gift from the sky, a scale of light. Oh, you're the Hylian who helped Prince Sedan. You're so handsome. Your looks still don't compare to Prince Sedan. You know, I, I ain't gonna go there because you're probably right. But you're not half bad. In fact, I wouldn't mind talking with you for a bit. He, You wanna talk? Uh, sure, let's talk about the song. I just love singing. I even remember the song from the Champion Festival. Aww. Do you want to hear it? Sure, why not? Oh. Okay, I'm going to sing it now. The Champion Festival song. A gift from the sky, a scale of light. Splits of the feet, a veil fall sight. Your trial awaits, it's glowing bright. I don't really get what the song's about, but I'm going to sing it at the next Champion Festival. It sounds like i got to go do a trial. <laughs> Mr. Tello is supposed to get the festival together, but he hasn't done anything for it yet. I wonder what's wrong with him. Did he forget that's his job? Mm. 
Ah, this is a shrine quest. Okay. Let's, uh... T -t 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 Alright, let's go talk to... Oh, we just gotta go up there. Alright, cool. Coolio! I knew you were the same Link from a hundred years ago. You did a fine job. I mean, Le how is this guy? Oh, no, that was the same one. I must devise a plan to find the ceremonial trident. The ceremonial trident is the fest. Wait, is that the one I broke? The Champions Festival light scale trident. Well, it's a fake. I plan to have that ceremonial trident examined by Dento, but on the way there, I dropped it off the bridge. It really doesn't matter, it was a fake after all. I'll have to ask Dento to make a new one. If someone happens to pick it up, they can just keep it. So... Is it... Was it up there? Where's it down? I guess it's up there. Uh, let's go check up there real quick. Wait, is that a trial? What is this? <laughs> Looks like a pad for the trial. Maybe like a trial's underground or something? Stasis is it? No. That doesn't do anything either, huh? Um Hold on, I I Okay, so I had to go back and get the spear first. No! Oh! Alright, ceremonial trident. Alright, so now we need to go back to here. I will cut back when I am there. Alright, so this is about to be really, really cool. So we're supposed to... We're supposed to swim upward. Get up here. And then while we're up here... Here we want to. That's not what we want to do. Oh wait, no. We could, oh wait, no. We can't work. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So we need to climb up the ele er, <laughs> climb up the waterfall. While we're up here, we go back down. I think I messed that up. Yeah, we need to. We need to do it like in this area right here where it's like deep water. So up we go. Spin back a little bit and go straight down. Is that not it? 
Am I doing it wrong? Oh, I'm supposed to do it on on this. Okay. I think I got it. Nah, I missed. Oh. That's rough. Okay. I missed again. Bro! This... <laughs> oh my god, this sucks. Oh. I could have just cheesed it like that. Oh my god. Oh? I thought it just would have popped up right there, but I guess over there is pretty cool too. Where is that right? Oh, it's right there. Sick. Da -da 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 -da. All right, let's go do this trial. Oh? Why did I turn this plate? Oh, that's what's up. This is my favorite one yet. Oh, I love this. Let's go! Hell yeah! So what I learned from that is I haven't been doing any of the shrine quests and there's quite a bit of them so add that to the list of stuff we need to get done. Anyway, I'm at the Zora. We're gonna try to squeeze in maybe two, maybe three more side quests this episode and then we'll call it an episode. Alright, let's start right here. Hi. What is it? Oh, hey, mister. Mm -hmm. You got a weird face. Racist. Mm -hmm. Hi, Lian? Never met one of those before. Really? Speaking of which, do high Lian's have any use for frogs? If you don't need your hot-footed frogs, why not donate them to me? Five frogs should do the trick, got it? Just gonna let you know I went here to grind for my frogs. There's quite a lot of them it's pretty common you literally just teleport to your uh, elephant friend and then you can paraglide down hey mister I'm busy here's your frogs okay I'm gonna go ahead and count them one two three four five wow you really brought them here take this as thanks this tough medicinal plant cannot be broken but it can be cooked Huh, neat. <laughs> Called an amaranth. I picked it because it's unusual, but it really doesn't suit me, so it's all yours. Also, what I've been doing is, um, I've been really trying to fill out some stuff in the Conum Compompedium thing. I do know I can drop something that I have and take a picture of it real quick, so that's going to be useful. I'm probably going to do that off camera. But, yeah, with that being done, let's go find the next side quest. Actually, I think I know which one I want to do. I think it's somewhere over here. It was somewhere. Is it this one? I think it's over here. Yep, this looks like it. <laughs> oh, you. Hi. It's me. I'm one of. I'm the one Prince Adon left at the top of the tower. Oh, what's up, dude? My guy, what is good? The name's Groove. In the end, I wasn't able to join up with Prince Adon. Instead, I worked up some fighting spirit and jumped into Zora River from the top of the tower, then I came back here. Okay. I was deeply moved to see my reflection on the water surface as I dove in. Yes, deeply moved. 
It is my observation that a person's true colors shine the brightest when they dive freely into the waves. Uh -huh. Congratulations on the new Zora armor. It is most impressive indeed. Wearing a Zora armor, even a Hylian like you can climb a waterfall and get back up here in no time at all. Uh -huh. That said, if you don't mind me asking, could you please show me your true colors as you dive into the water? You can dive head first from here into the water below. It'd be true beauty made flesh. Please consider. I messed that up. <laughs> uh, whoops. Finding brightness! Radiant beauty! <laughs> okay, now climb the waterfall and meet me back here. <laughs> Fantastic! Can you feel that? My soul is on fire! It's pulsating with beauty! You showed me something truly special. Thank you so much. Now then, come over here real quick. That was amazing! I saw your dive and waterfall climb with my own lucky eyes, and now those very eyes are flooded with tears of joy. Yes, I must thank you somehow. Oh, thanks, dude. Oh, I feel emotionally ravaged after that. It's not every day I get to see a diving form as beautiful as yours, you know? I'll be looking forward to your next dive. I really will. Excellent, excellent. Excellent. Alright. We have one more. I want to complete this episode. What's up, Prince? I believe it's over... Right here, I think it is. Hello. Link, the divine beasts have been appeased, but I fear there is still something that threatens the domain. There's a red main monster called a Lionel that lives on Polyamorous Mountain. Yeah, I, I, I remember that guy. I really need a picture of a Lionel. It can't be a picture of any red man Lionel, not just the one on the, not just the one on the mountain. So what do you say? Can you get me a picture? I uh, yeah, I, I got you, homie. I'm glad that was settled so quickly. See, there's this fool in the domain who good goads people into jumping off Shadow Back Point on Polyamus Mountain. It's an incredibly dangerous jump. This guy pressures people into jumping off by questioning their courage. He's a real bottom feeder. If he keeps this up, someone's going to wind up horribly injured. I need a picture of the Lionel to show everyone how scary they are. That way people will stop going up there. Does that answer your question, Link? I'll leave the details to you. Just bring me a picture of the Lionel so I can describe in detail. Alright, we gotta go up there. I guess I uh, will go through this way. We'll go up these um, go up these waterfalls. Oh yeah, I can get a bunch of shock arrows while I'm up here. This is going to be fun, but I'm going to end up dying, aren't I? Oh, <laughs> uh, well. You know, should I try to... No, I shouldn't try to fight this guy. I'm not prepared. But, like, I have a weapon that does 60 damage. I think it has, like, 2,000 HP. Where is... There he is. Alright, let's... Can I zoom in anymore? No. Is that good enough? I don't want to like not get a good enough picture. That's a good one. Draw on your bow. Oh no! There we go. That's a that's a cooler one. All right, we gotta go. Uh, 
<laughs> oh my god. Leave me alone. You are mean. You should leave me alone. See, I'm gone. Bye, bye, bye. <laughs> that was fun. I love paragliding so much. Alright, cut back when I get back to, um, Little Miss Send Me to My Death. Alrighty, Miss LaFlat. Hello, Link. How is that Lionel mission going for you? I have your picture. Oh, wow, please show me. What? <laughs> My apologies. That was sound was not very dignified, was it? P pardon me. I'm all better now. That Lionel, how terrifying. One look at this and I doubt anyone would get any reckless ideas about visiting Polyamus Mountain. Thank you. I'll tell all the children in the domain about this. Maybe that will scare them away about the scare them away from the mountain. All right. Now for your reward. Oh, that's cool. The Zora Greaves were once made by a skills craftsman by the order of the ancient Zora King. Now they're fairly common. As you may know, East Reservoir Lake was created in a collaboratory of collaboration between Hylians and the Zora. After East Reservoir Lake was finished, we made Zora Greaves as a token of our friendship for Zoras who ca or Hylians who came to visit. But over time, the Hy number of Hylians visiting the domain dwindled and my father had to close his armor shop. Those Zora Greaves here were the last pair left in, stock room, left in the stock room before he closed up shop. Wearing these, even a Hylian can swim as well as a Zora. That said, they'd be wasted on me. They are only useful for a Hylian like you. Please take good care of them. We absolutely will, and on that note, we are going to end it off. Next episode, we have a few, couple more side quests to do in here, as well as kind of just some off the beaten path. Obviously, now that I know there's shrine quests, I want to do them. And then we got to go back to Goron City and do all the side quests there. After that, after that, I'm probably going to try and go and do all the shrines in the area real quick. Like, I just want to be very, very powerful and very ready for the rest of the game. Because I have, like I said, I feel like I've been getting one hit a lot. And I don't like being one hit. And I know I'm not using foods, like defensive stuff. Also, I think I can up go upgrade my champion's tunic at the very least. I uh, went and checked that out before this episode too. But yeah, next episode... We're going to do more side quests. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see y'all next time.